Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we'll be looking at how to place a battery on the JBL Flip 5. This can be done by simply taking the JBL apart and swapping out the battery pack with a new one. But I've been looking online and there's very few Flip 5 battery available. And those that I found cost about $50 which is already half the price of the speaker. So today I'll show you guys how I replaced the Flip 5 battery with the new set of 18650 batteries which cost me low to nothing. First thing we're going to do is pry open these clips in order to remove the speaker grill. The grill should slide right off once all the clips have been released. The nice thing about this updated version of the Flip 5 is that the passive radiator frame is clip on instead of screw on, which makes dismantling the speaker super easy. So what we're going to do here is gently pry up these clips in order to release the passive radiator frame. There are also six clips in the center here that we will have to release also. With all the clip properly released, the frame should come right off along with the passive radiator, making taking the flip 5 apart super quick and easy. So let's look at the battery compartment. It's located right behind this sticky foam that you will need to remove. While we're here, let's remove these two white ribbon cables so we don't accidentally damage them. Now let's take out the driver by removing these four screws. Great thing these will be the only four screws that you will have to remove. We'll go ahead and unclip any cables and ribbons that we see here so we can slide out the motherboard and battery pack. We will have to be very careful and gentle as we don't want to accidentally rip out any cables or ribbons. Let's remove the battery pack and inspect it. This battery is a 4800 milliamp capacity that contains two UR18655ZM2 cells. We will carefully go ahead and dismantle the battery. I will be saving these foam installations so I can reuse them once I put the new battery pack together.
We'll go ahead and cut off this negative wire from the battery. We will then very carefully remove the nickel plate from the positive end of the battery. I will be replacing the stock cell with these LG ABE 18865 cells. These are rated at 3200 milliamp, so it will give me a longer play time than the stock battery. So what I'm doing here is just spot welding the new battery exactly as how the old one was. I will be using this heat string wrap to protect and hold the cells together. After attaching all the insulation onto the battery, let's put everything back together. Test it and it turns on and works normally. I've been using this speaker for the past weeks and it's been working great. And it also has a longer run time than when it still has the stock battery. Well that's it, I hope you enjoy and find this Flip 5 battery replacement useful. Remember don't forget to like, share and subscribe. There will be many more videos like this so you don't want to miss out. I'll see you next time.